Welcome to our 75th anniversary party. Well, congratulations. Well, how exciting. We're very excited to be here. When I heard that it was the 75th anniversary, I was like, oh my gosh, I can't believe it's been that long. But then I was like, but you've known about this your entire life. So yeah, it makes sense that it would be that long. No one really um, unites film and television uh, like the Golden Globes do every year. I mean, we're, we're just, we're all one big drunken family. I just love to see people dress up in the suits, the beautiful gowns, everyone, and everyone's so deserving of the awards that they win. Um, I love it. You know, all the other award shows, people seem nervous and tight, and at this, it just seems like, even when you're watching it at home, it seems like a fun party. I feel like my favorite Golden Globe speech was Emma Thompson's from a couple years ago. She like, walked on with her martini glass. I like that there's another se separate category. Um, we feel like somehow tears are more hard-earned than laughter, but I think Laughter is just as hard to earn in yeah. a movie. Comedy's not that easy. Yeah. Look at your how high pitched Comedy's not easy. Comedy's not that easy. So Eric, you actually co-hosted the show that we're going to see tonight. So it's exciting. No one better than us because we have been nominated 28 times and never won. That is the truth. We hold the record. We're very proud of it. Uh, that Will and Grace are the biggest losers ever at the Golden Globes. There's going to be a lot of funny clips, there's going to be a lot of moving clips, it's the speeches, because the speeches at the Golden Globes are generally a little freer uh, and a little more surprising sometimes than the Emmys or the Oscars. Um, and so we, we, guide, we guide America through that.